Hey, so today's question is, how do we tell a story with sound? And um, I think the specific limitation, or at least right now, is that how do we tell a story with sound without putting any words <laughs> to it, right? So if we have a bunch of words, then we can we can kind of follow the story and the music and the words link up, right? If we only have sound, the question is how do we how do we tell a story with that? Well, what is a story? A story is something that that uh, has at least to start with a beginning, middle, and end. And of course, at the beginning, we meet our characters. I guess we we see who the hero is. We see who the the bad guys are. I guess if you want to think of it like that. Um, and then in the middle, stuff happens. Yeah. But at the end, usually anyway, unless it's a you know horror movie of some sort, uh, uh, there's some sort of uh, happy ending, I suppose. So how do we do all of that, but only with these notes? And I think that's really the interesting question. Um, and what, what we have to do, of course, first of all, is we have to find some sort of connection with these notes, right? In other words, these notes, even though they're not words, they have to somehow be expressing something that I am feeling okay so that's that's really number one right uh, we think of a lot of different things when we're learning music as being number one but really the most important thing is that the music is is an expression of, of something okay so first of all what are we wanting to express happiness sadness uh, something in between longing um, you know loss right so so I've set up the beginning of something here, right? I'm, I'm starting out maybe uh, safely, let's say, or at least the, the beginning is, is introducing sort of the, the feeling or the style, and then where do I go from there? Now, um, usually when we think of something going somewhere musically, we think of there as, as being a sort of chord progression or something like that, right? A chord progression is a series of chords that, um, I, again, usually start with, with the tonic, take us away. So all of these things can be happening. Now, if I want to start really simply, let's let's break it down into, I want to make beginning and middle end. Uh, I'm going to have a really simple beginning, which is going to set the mood. I'm going to have a middle that's going to be something different, and then, and then back to the beginning, okay? And why don't I think of these two sections, or these, these two sort of characters as being major and minor, okay? So I'll have a major character at the beginning. <laughs> set things up right we have a sort of a playful character there in my left hand I have some chords okay so I have a nice kind of somewhere else. I went to the relative minor. That would be A minor. I was in C major at first. So 
So now I can contrast this. Something has happened in our story. Of course, we don't know specifically what, but... Okay. But it seems to have a sadder character or somebody's trouble or something like that. Right? So we can play around with that. section okay so I'm gonna do overall sort of a simple uh, ABA okay and that ABA is a really just sort of a basic storytelling um, premise that we have in music it's uh, uh, sometimes called rounded binary because we have two sections and it's rounded because the first one comes back so anyway uh, this will be a, a little improv on uh, ABA uh, a section being C major and uh, B section being uh, a minor section just to give it a nice kind of uh, ending there so anyway hope you enjoyed this video uh, please uh, leave comments if you have any questions or comments about my music or I'll see you next time